Okay, so this is my rock band pedal. I used a real pedal. No extra materials, no extra cost. Right, this is what I did. This is part of the rock band bass pedal. Alright, there. I just. The tip of mine was broken off, so I just used it. Duct taped it to my real pedal. Turned it around so that I can just turn this around. If I want to play on my real kit again. So. It's fairly simple, it's actually a double pedal. The other one goes in here. Um, this is the other part of it, the part that it hits on the rock band pedal. Just again, it was broken on mine, because I hit it really hard, so... I just uh, took it, duct taped it to this piece of wood. Duct taped that wood to my drum set. And if you want to see my ghetto drum set, there you go. No blue pad, no cords to fix it either. You know, so I just use the symbols. I actually have green and blue there, yes. Okay, so it really works. I got three or four complaints. Uh, when the bass pedal is not connected to a bass drum, you should, all drummers should know how this wobbles. So like, it's wobbly, wobbly like that. That, that makes it hard to do really fast double hits. So, that really sucks. Another thing is, if you hit it too hard, um, it will fall off track. Like, it'll move off to the side and start hitting there and won't work. And my last complaint, it's loud. It's really loud. I don't know if it's just the thing it's hitting or like, if you have something softer to hit, that's good for you. This is what I found, so just deal with it for now. Um, to do this, alright, you just cut this off cut this off. There's a little silver, silver piece right here. You gotta keep that in there. If you don't keep it in there then it won't work. So make sure you don't, like right in here, tape it in, don't lose it. You just find something to tape this to and play it comfortably and it should work. If it doesn't work then you didn't do it right because it's really not hard at all. You don't gotta move any wires, you don't gotta do anything but cut off and duct tape a few things. So, I'm just gonna play a song for you now on my ghetto freaking drum set. Rock band drums. Find the right camera angle here. Sorry, I've never done a rock band video before because I find it annoying when you, can, when you can hear the people hitting it. So, I'm just showing you this. I don't really care for it right now. You're probably not even gonna be able to see the screen. Anyway, here we go. The bass pedal takes a lot of getting used to, so don't complain about it. Just you really need to get used to it. So yeah, I've, I just put it on last night, as a matter of fact. So I'm still getting used to it, and it may fall off a couple times in the song because I don't have the drum kit pushed against anything, so it doesn't slide over or anything. So it will fall off track, and I will have to pause the song for a little bit sometimes in this video. I guarantee, because usually I have a bunch of clothes like pushed against it. But this room just got cleaned, yes, last night. So it's it's not. This is uh, my brother's room, actually. It's my nephew. Anyway, so, sorry about that. No, let's go. Let's go. Let me let me show you how this thing works. It really works good. No lag. No delay. No nothing. If there's a delay in the video, I'm sorry. That's the video's fault. But it works in real life just fine.
like it? It's working out pretty well. So I just hit the camera right there. Um, that, that's it. Works well. I'm surprised it didn't fall off track once there. Lucky me. Um, there you go. Don't go disliking this video. If, if you don't like it, just send me a message or something. I'll, I'll tell you what you did wrong if it doesn't work for you. Seriously, it, it, it should work. It works with any bass pedal ever. Anything. It's the simplest thing ever. Take some getting used to. Oh. I'll say hi to the people, Sean. <laughs> this is my four-year-old nephew. Um, yeah, that's it. Um, it should work just fine. Unless you did something wrong. Remember the silver piece. Don't let it fall out. It fell out, and I spent like five minutes trying to find it when I did this last night. So That's it. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it works for you. It really is very handy, especially if your bass pedal's crappy, like the one I had. Let me see if I can... Okay. This is it. This is what I was playing on. So, there we go. Bye.